Hello there ladies and gentlemen, how are you doing? It's Alexander Hilly 123 here and it's time for a new video. And as you can see from the title today, it is me discussing a game breaking glitch that has just occurred on Doom Eternal, which is forcing me to restart the mission. Doesn't sound so bad when I say it like that, but I've lost three hours of progress and it's all due to the devs not playtesting the game. This game so far has been absolutely fantastic and I've enjoyed it immensely. However, this is the first level, it's called the Super Goa Nest, where a bit of a Metroidvania has occurred. Metroidvania being when you can go into certain different areas and backtrack and whatnot and there's fast travel in this game but with modern games with reloading the checkpoint sometimes this can lead to game breaking issues because like I said the devs haven't play tested the game so this is a super goer nest when you get the red key oh shit and once you get the key from here these teeth will open a pinky will attack you and you'll be out in the open and you can fight the thing. Problem is, one of the challenges in this mission is to get three different glory kills on pinkies. I failed it. I got the same glory kill that I did one of the first two times. So I thought, let's restart encounter and let's do it again. How innocent of me. But this is the reason in games why I don't restart encounters and checkpoints. Because things like this can happen. Now I'm stuck in this room and I can't get out. I'm behind the teeth. And there is absolutely no way that I can get back. Not from here. Not from this location. That's blocked off. Obviously, I'm taking damage down here. There's two touch pads which both transport you back to the middle area. Exactly the same. And up here, it's a dead end. As you can see, well, that's where we came in initially from up there but there is absolutely no way that I can get out quick travel hasn't been unlocked yet in this area and I've just got to ask how on earth does a game get released a game as good as this gets released and somehow here we are and it's completely broken there's nothing I can do if I die It'll make no difference. Um, for some reason, the rockets aren't killing me. Some of this game's mechanics are frustrating as it is, but reloading checkpoint, as you will see here, will make no difference. Purposefully dying, reloading the checkpoint, nah. I read online that somebody had had a similar issue, not exactly the same issue, and funnily enough, it was in this mission where Metroidvania has arrived, and the well, someone else's suggestion was to start a prior mission earlier in the game, and then come back to this, and it hopefully will have worked, but I've tried it, it hasn't worked. Reloading checkpoint, not going to work. There's no way out. All I can do is restart mission. I've lost three hours of progress. Now, I'm sure because most gamers have absolutely no empathy or reasoning skills or common sense at times, there will be some stupid comments on this video perhaps, but when things like this happen to you, it's not nice because I don't want to have to redo three hours of progress. I'm a busy man and this game's fun, but... It's the reason that I'm doing it. It's because of the devs. <laughs> how on earth have they not playtested this part? How, how could they not know that this would happen? Is there a fix for it? Or is it just game breaking and that's it? Either way, I'm making this because I hope one of them sees it. They probably won't. But maybe other people will see it and will do something about it. It doesn't really matter for me though because... You know, I'm uploading this video for other people because I'm angry. I really am angry. I'm furious, actually. But chances are, I'm going to have to just restart the mission now. And once I get to this area, I'll know not to do that again, won't I? So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Even the best of video games have game-breaking bugs.